Look at me having a life. Look at me being both and mother busy. <laughs> Welcome to a new vlog. Uh, this week, I don't know what I'm gonna do this week, but I'm gonna jam pack up. For, I'm gonna figure out something to do so that way this vlog is exciting. Today's Sunday. This morning I went to Trader Joe's and then I went to a cute little farmer's market in DuPont Circle. I realized that I missed the other like thrift markets which were on Saturday. Didn't know that, now I know. I also went to Tate's Bakery. I've been to Tate's Bakery before. Other times I was in DC, so I wasn't like really wowed by it. It was basic coffee. Like I think DC has better coffee. Hot take, hot take. But I'll insert some montage clips of that now. I'm just about to eat dinner, do a little bit of work, and yeah, I'll see y'all after the montage is done. because we have a really major client coming into the office and we're also having dinner with them tomorrow so that's really exciting the only reason why i decided to pick up the camera was because i'm about to use my air fryer for the first time so shout out to my godfather and shout out to tati susanna for getting me this air fryer right, so let's plug it up reason why i'm using my air fryer today is because i need a quick dinner because <laughs> I'm literally about to eat this dinner and go to sleep so I can be well rested for tomorrow because it's a big day. My first time using this. If you watched my last vlog, you know that I got some air fryer liners. These are like a staple when I live back at home because everybody named Mama was using the air fryer. And I didn't want all my food to taste like bacon. It's actually the perfect size, really hot and spicy. Jones. Should I just make all of them? There's not that many in here. Oh, I wish I had cooking spray so I could spray these. It's really quiet. What? You can barely hear that. That is insane. High tech. High tech. What a great gift. Let me like get myself together. Maybe I can figure out what I'm wearing, all the things change out of these outside clothes i will see you guys tomorrow i don't know if i'm gonna get any content um i might sneak a little one two one two if i can but i'll come back when the food is ready and show y'all what it's looking like my dinner is done this is what it's looking like mm -hmm. yep yeah i don't even need to bring this big old thing in here do i yes i Thingy. It's perfect. 
I'm calling my grandma. Bye. Oh my gosh. These are so nice. These are so nice. Finally have some bar stools. Finally got some big pieces. I'm so excited. Thank you so much to my grandma. I don't even know if she watches my vlogs, but I'm gonna make her watch this little segment of me building it. I'm not gonna build it now. I'm actually about to go out. It's Thursday. Thursday, Thursday. I'm about to go out. Maybe I'll film a little bit of me going out. Um, maybe not. I'm going out again on Saturday. Back outside, girls. Back outside, girls. Yeah, but I'll see y'all a little bit later. Hello, vlog. I look absolutely insane for right now i will look better soon i'm getting ready to go out today but i need to build my bar stools because Rhi is gonna come in pre-game here and i still haven't built them and i want her to have a place to sit um i also went out and got a couple things but i'll show you guys that after because it's i got lots to do and i also got new lights for my bathroom too because i want it to be a little bit brighter in there so let's build these bar stools together and i'm gonna be a baddie later baddie is loading okay so let's do it. surprisingly easy to set up it was like four steps dangerously easy <laughs> um let me show you guys what i got from the store just some little mixers to make a little drinky drink Yo. i also got some lashes and scrunchies i just got some serving plates because i don't have any small little plates like this got some serving plates for a little snack and dip moment i didn't have any like margarita cups so i got these from ross this would not have been my cup of choice but they didn't have many options so yeah, i just got these two let's do the lights in the bathroom and then let me start getting ready because time is of the essence i made a nice little setup pre-game setup for Rhea and i we're about to Get ready to go make some drinks, you know. She's in the bathroom doing her lashes. Hi. I don't know. I just changed these lights. But I don't know how I feel about them. We'll see. We'll see. I'm not dressed yet. Um, I only have on the base. But I'll put on my jacket and my shoes later and do a little fit check later. <laughs> Talk about some things we can undo. I'm just in the pit, I can find you. Six one on the money, nine two. You just said a word. Hello vlog. Today is Sunday. I definitely have a little bit of Sunday scaries. Like last week was rough. Last week was rough. And I'm really hoping that this week is better because I think last week I started off like feeling under the weather, but downhill from there. So I'm really hoping that this week is a lot better. I'm not even uploading a vlog today because I really didn't do anything last week but work. So I have no content for y'all. I have no content to post enough for a weekly vlog. Today I'm gonna use this time to like get inspired about like what I can do for next week. I did my hair, I washed it and I straightened it because I don't have a choice. Otherwise, we all know that I've been having um, hairstylist debacles. So yeah, but I'm about to go to Home Depot and get Scotch Guard for my bar stools. Like they are so cute. Some Scotch Guard for those because I don't want them to get messed up. Like you see how pretty they are. Come on. I also need to get some groceries. I think I'm gonna meal prep for this week um, and not even try and be cute and do the most. Like I'm gonna make these lasagna rolls, these Alfredo lasagna rolls. And I'm gonna make burgers this week. Those are gonna be like the two things that are gonna be a little more fun. So let's go. Back from the store. Let's 
Scotch guard these chairs. Chairs have been scotch guarded, so fingers crossed it protects them because these are now my babies and I have to protect them by any means necessary. No vlog today, so I'm not editing today. I am gonna watch some vlogs though, relax, cook. I'm gonna make lasagna rolls tonight, so I'll record me doing that. That's all that I got from the store. I went to Walmart, but everything is basically empty, so I just have to go another day because there was no food in there. So that's next. Anyway, I'll come back to y'all later when I'm cooking, but for right now, I need to relax. I'm back. <laughs> I literally have been in my bed, just rotting away for the past couple of hours. 7.38, and I need to get started. So, let's make these, these lasagna rolls. Um, I'm gonna start by boiling the water, and then after that, I'm going to, um, yeah, I'm gonna start with boiling the water. Let's season the chicken and cook the chicken, so, that could be ready for the for the filling. watch my vlogs but or I don't know if this is TMI to my girlies out there but my cramps my cramps have literally been kicking my butt and the only thing that helps when I have cramps is sparkling water and I love sparkling water on a regular day but when I have cramps oh, I have an extra appreciation for it oh god my lasagna rolls are in the oven I made some broccoli to go with it because I need a little vegetable also making some garlic bread too, but yeah, this meal was very interesting to make, I will say. I'm gonna come back to y'all when the lasagna rolls are done. Well, Alfredo is always good, like, yes. My mom said I'd be lying on my vlogs about the, the food that I eat. But I'm not lying, like, you really can't mess up Alfredo. This is Alfredo in a different outfit, so. Mm. That is really good. That is great, that is good. I think he put his food. If you don't know how to cook, you just can't follow directions. I'll see y'all later. Vlog, I'll talk to y'all next time I pick up the camera. I'm gonna fix the angle in a second, but today it is super nice outside. Today is Tuesday, um, so I'm gonna take you guys to my roof. I haven't been on my roof since I toured, um, and that was like the dead of winter, so it was freezing. But today I think it's like 70 degrees outside, and the people I was in the elevator with just now, they're already going to the roof. So I'm I'm already preparing myself for the madness. Um, I was also thinking about going to $5 Tuesdays, but we'll see about that. Because today is Tuesday, and I just need to like watch a movie or something. Go to the theater. I'm going to bring me a little ice pop. Enjoy the amenities that I pay for. I don't even know if this is too hot. I mean, it's 71. It's not freaking 90 degrees. It's 71 degrees. I still need a little hoodie. Dang. I've seen people go up there in shorts. I'm like, it's not that warm, is it? Anyway, <laughs> let's go up to the roof, see what the vibes are. I'm sure it's probably lit up there, but let's go see. Back from the 
not swimming in it right now. It's not that warm. Look, it look good. Like it's definitely looking like it's gonna be a vibe up there. It wasn't that warm today. It was warm for sure. But I'm interested to see like how it's going to look up there when it's even warmer outside. Like if I'll even get a spot up there. I also did get the ticket for the movies, so I'm gonna go to the movies. It's a nice little solo date day. Okay, look at this day turning around. I'm gonna go see Kung Fu Panda 4. I actually just recently watched the trilogy. I think it was on Netflix, so I watched Kung Fu Panda 1, 2, and 3. I will say Kung Fu Panda, what was my consensus? Kung Fu Panda 1 had the better villain, but Kung Fu Panda 2 had the better story. I think that's what my consensus was. I think I tweeted about it. I'm gonna insert the tweet here somewhere. But the reason why I was so excited to watch Kung Fu Panda 4 was because the same thing happened when I watched Hunger Games. And I watched the trilogy and then right after that, they announced the next movie, Ballad of the Songbird. And the villain in that is Viola Davis. And literally, I just watched the trilogy for Kung Fu Panda and they announced um, Kung Fu Panda 4. And the villain for that is also Viola Davis. I'm like, wow, like what are the odds? Anyway, that's just like a weird little synchronicity that happened. But um, the movie's at 8.20. It's 7.28 now. I need to figure out what I'm going to eat. I actually think, I kind of think I should meal prep. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all because if I eat now, I'm not gonna have any food to, for tomorrow. I'm definitely getting popcorn at the movie. I always get popcorn at the movies. I'm gonna take you guys to the movies with me. Obviously, I cannot film the entire movie, but I'll do a little montage moment and let's go to Georgetown to go watch Kung Fu Panda. <laughs> Wednesday. Um, I actually decided to go to work today. So I am going to be working from home tomorrow and Friday. Just to like do a little reset, spend a little time in my apartment. Basically work from home and just be in my space. Cause last week was very hectic. Like we had a major client in our office last week. So I'm still trying to come down from that. I got home around Seven ish. I actually been walking home. The weather's been really nice. I stopped at the grocery store to get um, some ingredients to make these burgers that I'm about to make. I'm gonna make a burger with um, a blue cheese burger um, with arugula. And arugula tastes so good on a burger. I don't know if you guys have ever tried it, but it's very good. I'm gonna make some fries with it. When I got home, I made brownies. Like, I literally did the opposite of what i made the dessert before i made the dinner something's not clicking like that's why i gotta work from home the next two days like i'm not all the way there and i've been sitting here literally watching vlogs and furniture shopping i think it's a tiktok ban the potential tiktok ban that has lit a fire under my behind but like i don't understand why i'm not growing on youtube and it's so frustrating to me so i'm literally just trying to see whatever i could see to get inspiration figure out new content ideas like i've already done rsvp and book myself for everything i can possibly book myself to make these videos more interesting and also align with things that i still enjoy i'm just trying to find furniture because that is something that like furnishing this place is something that is really special to me and that I am enjoying doing. And I'm sure that you guys are enjoying like the additions to the space and everything. So that's what I've been trying to do today. It's really hard to furniture shop. I won't even lie to you. Like I'm very particular. I have no couch in here. I don't even know how much context I gave when I moved here, like of how chaotic, like I literally looked at apartments one weekend, signed the lease and just moved out from my mom's house. like. Just moved out. I did not have anything. Like, I'm telling you, starting from zero, like, zero, no furniture. Like, the only thing I ordered in advance was a bed and a mattress. I had nothing else outside of that. I lived with my mom. I'm not gonna just take her couch. <laughs> we are in a real honest transparency moment if you made it to this part of the vlog. I've been, on, I've been on Wayfair, I've been on Ikea, I've been on Pinterest, just trying to like get inspired, get inspired. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to these next two days working from home and yeah, just getting back, just getting back to myself a little bit. What do y'all think about the TikTok ban? Comment down below. 
but I'm not for a TikTok ban. Like, if they ban TikTok, I don't know what I'm gonna do with my days. <laughs> what am I gonna do when I wanna be, turn my brain off and be mindless? What am I gonna do then? Um, but I've been getting back into my YouTube bag anyway, so. <laughs> I've been back on my YouTube girlies binge. Like, YouTube girlies wake up. TikTok might be gone. TikTok just chatting. Let's make these burgers, please. because the oil was popping me. Let's eat and taste this. Missing something. I think I need ketchup. Like, it's good. Y'all know I'm biased. I think all my thinking is good. Let me clean up, go to bed, and I'll talk to you. Hello vlog. I am currently at happy hour here with Ree. Well, I'm about to meet Ree. Great. <laughs> Ghetto? Who do I? Wow, now you're on camera saying that. You're on camera. That's the truth. There's I mean, you're gonna see it. No, if it's real, it's real. <laughs> I, love you. I love me a hood jail. I, I love, love me a hood jail. jail. <laughs> Empty lounge. Cheap. Hookah lounge in DC. The vibes in the tools. So we're going to a hookah lounge in DC. Yes. On a Thursday. <laughs> Again. I mean, this spot right here. Yep, right here. I'm feeling like this is gonna be my life now. Yes. <laughs> Yo, We're gonna have Thursday, to Friday, Sunday, back and under. Back and back, back and back. Hello vlog. Today is Fry Yay. Fry Yay. Literally so excited. It's Friday. Um, right now it's a 544. I'm about to go to Whole Foods and get some flowers and some wine because we invited me to her roommate's game night. Um, and it's her roommate's birthday, so I don't want to show up empty-handed. Don't show up empty-handed to the way house. Um, I'll probably bring a game. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go grab that. I also want to edit this vlog a little bit because I'm not gonna have um that much time on Saturday to edit it, and I don't want to edit it on Sunday, so I need to get as much done as possible before I go. I want to do a TikTok concept of like FaceTime vibes, um, but in the form of a get ready with me. So I'm gonna have time to do that because I hate when I'm rushing to do like TikTok content. I've been having ideas come to me so much. I don't know if it's because TikTok is about to be banned, but um, there was something else I was gonna say. Oh, yesterday, yesterday I went to happy hour. It was so nice. I met Amber, but she was so nice. She was so sweet. And we had a good time. Like we went to get hookah afterwards. Like now we're all in the group chat. We're gonna go see a basketball game soon. So like, Look at me, I'm making friends, making friends. Also planning to get um, lunch tomorrow with one of my old friends from elementary school, getting my nails done tomorrow, cause y'all, I've had these nails on since Valentine's Day. This nail is literally broken. I don't know if you guys can tell, like look how grown out it is, first of all. Um, but this nail is broken. I'm surprised it hasn't like, let me just shut up before I even say something that I don't wanna say. I think I might be going out tomorrow too. <laughs> So I need to take it easy. What is going on on Sunday? Oh, and Sunday I'm doing that thrift crawl, but that'll probably be in the next vlog. Yeah, look at me having a life. Look at me being booked and mother busy. I can finally see the life that I pictured and envisioned for myself here coming into fruition day by day, and I love it. Let's go to Whole Foods and get these items. Selfishly, I'm gonna get the sweetest wine possible because 
I had a margarita, yes, two margaritas yesterday, and it put me on my butt, my behind. So I need something like sweet, 5% alcohol, like selfishly, like I'm gonna bring what I wanna drink because I know that they're gonna be wanting to do shots, they're gonna wanna do all these things. So I need to have a safe, safeguard, security blanket of like what I'm gonna be able to drink because I cannot with the hard liquor. Let's go, because I'm just, y'all know me, I just be. <laughs> I'm finished getting ready. I did like a little get ready with me on my TikTok. Got the wine, got the flowers. I wrapped them up very nice. I just wrapped them in a paper bag that I had. Anyway, I'm late. Let me finish my burger and leave because I also have to go to the um, ATM to get ones. There's going to be a game where there's going to be ones involved. So let's go. I will see y'all when we get there.
morning y'all it is the next day and it is literally 7 33 in the morning i have a nail appointment and me and the girl i just texted the girl and we texted each other at the same time i was like are we still on because y'all know i'm literally traumatized by these technicians and she was like girl we yeah. Thinking the same thing. She literally texted me, um, do you have my address? When I was like, there, are we still on? So I'm about to head over. She was like, you can stay. You can sleep in if you want. I was like, no, girl. Like, I'm already up. Let's do it. Like, let's do it. So I'm about to get my nails done. Really, really excited. Because my nails look in freaking insane. Like, Bigger warning. I'm about to show my pimples. <laughs> but I had two pimples right here. If you guys can tell. And these pimple patches, I was literally putting my mom on. They didn't work for my mom. But she I think she just didn't use them right. But I had two pimples right here. And I love these pimple patches because they literally like, mm, like physically like suck out all the gunk. These are the pimple patches that I use. They are so good. Now I've had a pimple that's really bad. Look at that. I literally flattened the pimple and took everything out of it. That's why I'll never trade, like, I'll never trade on these. Ugh, that is just too satisfying. I'm sorry if that was so nasty, but I had to put you guys onto these pimple patches because they're my saving grace. But let me get ready. Uh, does the toilet not know that I'm walking? Um, anyway, so rude. I'm about to get ready, wash my face, go get some coffee, and I'll see y'all at my nail appointment, nail appointment, nail appointment. Fenty um, gloss balm heat in a slipper. So just the clear one. I wanted a lip plumper. Um, I was about to get the Too Faced one, but then I was like, let me try this one because the Too Faced one is nice for like plumping your lips. But I like the finish of the Fenty um, gloss bombs. Let's try this one out. If I don't like it, then I'm just gonna go back and get the Too Faced one. I also, this is the best face wash. This La Roche Posay, this has gotten my skin so right. They're a whole line. I use this, I use the toner. They also have a spot treatment. I don't use that as much, um, but I needed to re-up on this. When I say the very last drop, I mean it, like it's empty. And this is the only thing that works for me, works for my skin, so I'm gonna live and die by this. I am going, I do wanna do a Target like hygiene video or like incorporate it into one of the vlogs, so that might be in the next vlog, so hit that subscribe button. Also lost, when I first got here, I lost my MAC chestnut lip liner. Expensive pain, I know, I know. So I just got a new one because yeah, this is like a holy grail and I've realized like I need her. <laughs> this fragrance oil from Ulta, this fragrance oil is so good. If you wanna smell like a vanilla cupcake, just, this is just like pure vanilla. Like this is if you put vanilla extract on your body. Like it smells so good, it lasts so long. I love to douse myself in this, like literally douse myself. This is the new one and then this is the old one, like literally. It's probably like a drop in there. If I like something, and I'm a Virgo, like a creature of habit, if I like something, it's curtains. Like, I'm going to keep re-upping on it. So, this will be the only new thing that I'll be trying for this, um, from this, like, shopping haul or whatever. 
Um, I got my car washed today. Finally got my car washed. I wasn't able to get it like vacuumed by the people there. Um, so I just went ahead and did it myself. I have my own vacuum. Um, and I'll link that down below. It, get, it got the job done. Like, my car is clean again. Like, finally. Finally clean again. My nails. Um, hello. What the freak? She literally snapped. She requires, like, you send an inspo pic before your appointment so that way she can practice, like, whatever it is that you send. And I actually went to my photo. I had it up on my photo app. And I was like, damn, she sent me a picture of my nails? But it was literally the inspo pic that I sent her. She did She did it so, like, on point, like, so close to the inspo picture to the point where I thought the inspo picture was my nails. If the lady in the inspo picture didn't have a tattoo on her finger, I would have thought that was me. I was like, oh, dang, like, why don't you send me a picture? So I love her. I love her work. Like, and we just be having a key. We it's been a pretty productive Saturday. I'm actually about to get lunch with an old friend from elementary school, and then later tonight I'm going out. So I am going to end the vlog here. But it was an exciting vlog. Like next week, hopefully we have some cool things in store. I'm gonna try and you know fill up my week same way I did it this time, and just figure out and just get myself out there more. Like I feel like vlogging and wanting to have exciting content is like literally pushing me out of my shell, and I love that for me. So. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Do not forget to follow me on all my other socials because TikTok be getting some things that y'all don't see. Instagram be getting some things that y'all don't see. But you guys also get some things that they don't see. But be sure to follow me on all of them so you're a part of the Naomi ecosystem. Okay. And do not forget to subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.